Well, the 10-year-old little girl is recovering at Children's Mercy Hospital tonight, but doctors say the road to recovery will be a journey the little girl will have to work on for her whole life. Amy Holly found out what's next in her future. Amy? Well, nobody can say just how long the girl's mother confined her daughter to a closet, but doctors say it doesn't matter whether it was a week or years, her nutritional and relationship deprivation may be something she never will fully get over. While a girl was stuck in a closet and starved, prosecutors say her mother, Jacole Prince, took her other two younger girls from a different father out to eat. Neighbors say the abused victim's father died recently. Psychiatrists say a parent will sometimes target one child because he or she often represents trauma in the parent's life. All the things she hates about herself and about the child's father and the circumstances around that. Prosecutors say the victim said her mother was the only adult who would put her in the closet and that she would get hit on the back when she would throw up small amounts of food that were rarely given to her. It's why in a circumstance like this, doctors often introduce food to a starved child through an IV or a feeding tube. If you've been starved, your stomach actually shrinks. It's not used to the food. Doctors say starvation in developmental years will have lasting effects into adulthood. It affects the entire body and this girl is at a hugely increased risk for osteoporosis later in life. Children are amazingly resilient, but doctors say it's almost impossible for a young developing brain to forget trauma and that kind of abuse reaches far beyond the victim. This child was completely alone in the world. But if you don't have adequate attachment as a child, you don't care what the teacher thinks. You don't care what the babysitter thinks. And then later on, you don't care what society thinks. And that won't only cost the victim, but doctors say society. And doctors say an unbelievable one in four children now experience some sort of trauma by the time they are the age of four. The cost of society is enormous. Psychiatrists say about $125 billion a year, more than it costs to treat many major diseases. Amy Holly, 41 Action News.